Hi guys. I come back. <laughs> guys, can I just explain this? I'll keep disappearing and reappearing in Hashem. Like, I think I run out of ideas to post about, if I'm being frank. Like, I'm not even going to lie to you. I don't know what to talk about. Hence the disappearing and stuff like that. So, welcome back if you are returning. Thank you for coming back and welcome if you're new. Thank you for um, subscribing to my channel, to all the new subscribers. And if you have not subscribed, please do hit the subscribe button. Guys, um, road to 700 uh, subscribers is, is it's coming along. It's coming along so well. And it's actually like a shocker. For me, like I still can't believe it. But anyway, thank you very much for subscribing to my channel, and thank you for coming back. If you really are like, you know, one of those that regularly come back and check out my channel, I really do appreciate that. Guys, today's video is a bit on a light side of life. Like it's not a serious video, really. Like it's not, it's not that deep, you know. But I thought I should come and vent. I thought I should just come here and just pour it out <laughs> so um i just want to say firstly congratulations to guys i removed my nail polish yesterday so my nails are long they look nicer when they have the nail polish on but right now they don't i just want to give them some rest anyway congratulations for those of you that are um moving soon i've, I've been getting inboxes of people who say that oh stop um i'm almost there and some of them are thanking i mean, I mean of course the whole purpose of starting this channel was to assist other people so seeing people move i'm not saying obviously they get all the information from me but knowing that i'm part of the people that impacted their you know lives positively it just makes me happy so congratulations to you if you're moving soon and if you have not started applying because you want to get in next year, beginning of next year, and you think, no, it's too early. If you want to get in um, in February, right, beginning of the second semester, you should be applying as you speak. Like, you should be preparing your paperwork, at least. You should be, especially the police clearance uh, certificate, we know that uh, that one takes some time so you should be at least somewhere with gathering your documents and okay unless you're planning on applying at the beginning of the next academic year then you still have a bit of time okay so if you have not started like just start right away so that February when they say and Phoenix group is actually hiring as we speak Phoenix group has been posting on their Facebook um that they are looking for teachers so obviously them posting that they are hiring means they are openings and who's going to fill those openings if you guys are not applying i don't know okay so i just i thought i should just let you know maybe in in, in case you were not sure how to apply where to get the jobs phoenix group asia has a, a facebook group that is actually active they do post about work there and they are the agency that i used to move and they are one of the best agencies like i'll forever talk about phoenix group asia <laughs> i forever will anyway moving along to what i'm actually here for guys i am so sad well not not really so last year when i came here so this is some of uh, 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 like these are some of the things that you should actually prepare yourself for moving to Taiwan. like it's not I'm not used to it. It's not, okay, maybe it's not culture shock, but it's one of the things that you should really prepare yourself for. Guys, there is no December. There is no December. Like, guys, I am in November, ne? and we all know when the months start ending in November, we are in the first step season. Like, October, November, September, October, November, December. There's no December, guys. I mean, there is December, <laughs> as in the month, but there's no holiday in December here. Like, last year when I came, I came on the 
16th of December, right? So I guess I kind of did experience December a bit and I wasn't working for the whole, for the whole of November. So I just wanted to, to start work right away. I did not even care. This year I get to experience not having a December for the first time in my life. I don't know how I feel about it. It's like, and Shem, like, in as much as I don't do much when I'm at home during the festive season, I really don't. I just stay at home and, you know, but the family is there. We're having fun. We're singing. Like, it's a joyful season. It really is a joyful season. Um, if you're African, it's a very joyful season. Like, the festive season is really, you know. So, I'll be working for the whole of December, except for except for the first of January. Yeah, no January, I mean since it's good January even it doesn't even count because Christmas Day, the twenty fifth of December, I me will be at work. <laughs> How? Why? I'm so heartbroken. Like I don't wanna lie, I'm out here pretending as if I'm okay, but I'm not. I am actually going to be at work. Got Christmas, guys. Like when people are wearing their Christmas clothes, and Christmas clothes actually this year we all deserve Christmas clothes. Yes, deserve. It's it's been, you know, we deserve Christmas clothes. So, was I want to make Christmas clothes, and now I'll be at work working i'm not okay <laughs> last year it was during the weekend so i really didn't like i didn't feel it because i was virtually like there with family um like i was watching as they opened the gifts and everything you know as part of everything even though i wasn't there physically so now this year, I mean, of course, by the time they do it, it's going to be, you know, I'll, I'll, I'd have knocked off, I'll be in my place and everything. But the fact that, I mean, I know that it's a miracle. I'm not happy. So this is something you should prepare yourself for mentally or whatever. Like if you take Christmas like that serious. Well, for me, it really, it's not that deep. But knowing that everyone back home is, is going to be, uh, you know, on holiday and I won't. <laughs> I'm jealous. <laughs> I am so jealous. But it's, it's a life I chose, I guess. So I was just here to vent, guys. Like, I was just here. I can't, I can't believe it. We actually were planning on going somewhere when we discovered that, no, actually, it's just a normal day. I thought it was going to be a long weekend. Nyana. No, it's not. So we do get the 1st of January off. On the 2nd, we're back to work. Yeah, that's it. Like, that's, that's what I was here for, guys. Like, please send me Christmas presents. I need them. <laughs> I need them. Because what? Anyway, um, yeah, so, honestly, like, this video was all about that. I just, like, I'm still trying to process the whole thing. <laughs> Okay, guys. Bye. Thank you for watching. Oh, and I will be vlogging. There's an event that's coming up. Okay. If you are in Taiwan and you're new and you don't know what to do, there's an event coming up, um, Safa Fest, which is a festival for South Africans. And I don't, I don't think it's for South Africans, but it's called that. I think that's, that's, that was the origin. But we meet people from different countries, um, from different African countries. There's a whole lot of people from Swaziland. And, okay, 
it's mostly people from Swaziland and people from South Africa. And then there are l locals, a few locals and people from other countries. But like, it was so nice last year. I'm not saying you don't want to miss, but I'm just letting you know that, you know, I mean, of course it was, it started off, you know, it was a slow thingy, but then eventually when they started playing music from back home, they played for six months, 20, they played, like the DJ knows the kind of music that makes us feel like, wow, I miss home. We had that, it was so nice. There's a bride, there's, they sell things from um, back home, like your sauces, your spices, your wines, your beer, and, and, and that you know from back home. So they sell that. Of course, the, the price is a bit, you know, because those things are expensive here. So just in case someone may be interested and they do not know, it's happening next weekend on the 18th of November in, I don't know, I don't know. You can inbox 